The Masters of Applied Digital Learning at Lamar University is a collaborative learner-centered program that embraces technological innovation through authentic learning opportunities and prepares the learner to create meaningful change in their organizations. We believe that we must inspire and prepare our learners to lead organizational change by using technology innovations as catalysts for enhancing learning. To do this, we create a significant learning environment and give our learners choice, ownership, and voice through authentic learning opportunities. We refer to this as a CSLE plus COVA approach. Sometimes we just refer to it as COVA. We use a COVA approach to prepare our leaders who can then lead organizational change and drive innovation in a digitally connected world through the authentic learning opportunities that they can realize in their learning environments. ADL students learn how to purposely assemble all the key components of effective learning and create their own significant learning environments. We have constructed a program map to help you understand how ADL courses fit into the significant learning environment and to help you understand how best to work through the program. The structure of the courses and the program itself are designed to guide you through the authentic learning process. Your instructors will also guide you in making effective choices and help you to fully embrace ownership of your learning through your authentic project. To help you understand how the ADL program works and how all the pieces fit together, you'll want to use the analogy of a house. EDLD 5305 makes up the footing or the foundation for the entire ADL program. In this foundational course, you will develop an authentic innovation that you will implement in your organization. You will create an innovation plan that will include an innovation proposal or letter, a literature review, an implementation outline or strategy, and a call to action video. This innovation plan will become the foundational project for the rest of the ADL program. The next two courses are also part of the foundation and you will be using many of the ideas, methods, and learning approaches from these foundational courses in other ADL courses. In 5302, Concepts of Educational Technology, we start you exploring the power of choice, ownership, and voice through authentic learning. We also expose you to a wide assortment of ideas like failing forward, feedback, feed forward, and most importantly, the growth mindset and the learner's mindset, where we ask you to start thinking about how you learn and how you learn to learn. In 5303, we give you the time to explore choice and take full ownership of your e-portfolio, which will become a central component of the ADL program. Your e-portfolio is also your primary tool in which you'll find your voice and share ideas with the rest of the world. In the next two courses, 5304 and 5313, you will build on your ideas that you established in the innovation plan. Since your innovation plan is something you will pilot in your own learning environment, you will also want your learners to have the same benefits when they leave your classroom or your learning environment. So you will want them to have the same powerful learning experience that you created for them. Therefore, you will want to share your ideas with your colleagues in your organization and encourage them to join you in using technology to enhance the learning environment. In 5304, you will learn to leverage the notion that people don't buy what you do, they buy why you do it. And you will build powerful why, what, and how statements that will become your central theme behind your organizational change strategy. You will also explore how to leverage the six sources of influence and expand your implementation plan and develop a strategy to have crucial conversations to move your ideas forward. In 5313, you'll continue to build on your innovation plan by exploring how to shift the culture of learning and then look more closely on identifying your personal learning philosophy. This learning foundation is then going to be applied to a backward design principles that you will use to create course plans that you will then also create your own significant learning environment. In 5315, you'll build out an action research plan that will help you to determine if your innovation plan is really making the difference that you hoped it would. In 5317, you'll take a closer look at the specific technologies that you'll be using in enhancing your learning environment, and you'll also further develop your voice as you prepare to publish your work. In 5318, you'll take the course plan that you developed in 5313 and use it as a foundation for either an online or blended learning course that you will develop and share with your intended audience. In 5389, you'll argue why the traditional sit and get model of professional learning or development really doesn't work or it's not effective. In contrast, you will use the five key principles of effective professional learning and development to create a comprehensive go and show model of professional learning and development. You will then use this model to help your colleagues further their own learning. 
Finally, in 5320, your capstone course, you'll pull all the pieces together, um, everything from your learning journey, and reflect on what worked and what you can do better. You will also continue to move your ideas forward and implement or finalize your innovation plan. You will have the opportunity to reflect on how you created a significant learning environment in which you gave your learners choice, ownership, and voice through authentic learning opportunities. Once you see the bigger picture of your ADL experience, you will then be able to better embrace and take ownership of the specific learning opportunities that you will have in each of the courses. Since authentic learning is central to the ADL program, fully embracing the ownership of your authentic project will help you in creating your own significant learning environment and will help you with success in the program and more importantly, success as you move forward to enhance your learning for your learners.